Chantel. Um, I am 25 years of age and I work at Mall Station Native Nursery. Um, it's west and it's very drought over there at the moment, very dry. But I myself am interested in growing bush tuckers and edibles um, so that we can bring my culture back and show people and communities that we can go out and collect edibles and use them within our cooking these days. At the moment I'm focusing on doing a garden cafe with my mother in Bonalbo and we are in the process of doing up a 10 year business plan for that where I will be propagating and growing bush edibles. I am propagating and um, growing Australian natives at Mole Station Native Nursery and in that role we do a lot of weeding, a um, lot of cuttings, um, seeding and also pricking in and thinning out. We grow as a wholesale nursery and we sell to retail nurseries all over Australia. So we go up to Warwick and Toowoomba, all the way down to Sydney and Melbourne. Uh, a typical day in the nursery is actually really calming for me. This is how I found that this is my passion. I have worked in several industries and several jobs um, where it has made me a lot uh, stressed and it has made me not be myself. Where when I got introduced to horticulture by Sarah and David Caldwell, they actually um, had me come into the nursery just for a day and see how I went and I absolutely loved it and I do not want to leave this industry at all. Um, so in a, in a normal day for me, I'll rock up at work half an hour early because why not? I love being early and I love knowing um, that I can walk around the garden in the morning just to wake up with a cup of coffee. A lot of young people should get into horticulture these days. Um, being an um, Aboriginal um, woman, I think that young people should be giving back to the earth. Um, a lot of damage is being done by people not knowing um, the, you know, how to actually look after the earth and look up, put back to the earth. So we have a lot of young people these days who. Um, do just go out and take, 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 but they don't really give back. So I think young people in horticulture is a big step and I think it should definitely, definitely have a lot more young people in horticulture. Um, it's just knowledge, knowledge of the land, knowledge of plants, knowledge of what we can do with these plants and how plants can actually help us. Um, without trees and without um, like wildlife we would be very plain people and I don't think that we would survive very well.